Hello everybody. Today we continue with the forward part of the center section and we're going to install the forward bulkheads and the auxiliary longer ones. I took a different position for the camera so now you can see the inside better. As you can see I already have installed some auxiliary longer ones and I'm now installing the bulkheads, the forward bulkheads. So those are the bulkheads in front of the main bulkhead that you can see in the bottom where the wings will be attached to. There are a lot of small parts here and also there are a lot of parts that need um, doubling or let's say strengthening. So sometimes you have to make stiffeners or doublers or those kinds of things. And again you have to attach the skin to all these longer ones and um, bulkheads. So now I'm probably working on the outside, uh, clecoing and drilling the skins to those longer ones. As you can see on the, uh, the firewall, on the corners there are those white angles which attach to the longer ones and they are uh, made of steel the rest is all aluminum. Sometimes I use a light so that I can better see what I'm doing on the inside. Now I'm at attaching the, um, the bulkhead to the main longer one on the top side. My, my drill bit was dull, dull so I had to uh, yeah, drill for a long time. I figured it out and I replaced the drill. I drill the, uh, the thick material with uh, cheap drills so that I'm, I don't make my good drills dull. And as what I said earlier, I drill them a little bit smaller so I can uh, make small adjustments. Okay, now I'm working on... Oh, this was the next day. I'm now working on the uh, wing tank attach angle on the outside. So again there are doublers and stiffeners to mount that uh, attach angle because there will be some weight on there because the front part of the wing is attached to that part. So the main part of the wings are in the main bulkhead but there where I'm working now uh, the, the front part of the wing is attached. I do it on both sides, so every time I do some work on the left side and then I do the same work on the, l on the right side. The drawings are mostly made for the left side, so the drawing is only, only shows one, let's say, side of the, of the plane. And you have to do the other side in, let's say, mirror image. So they didn't make drawings for, let's say, the left side and the right side. You have to figure it out yourself. But that's okay. Again, working on the angle now on the right side of the plane. And as you can see, it takes a long time. I mean, the, the outside skins, that went very fast. So uh, it starts to look like a plane very fast. And now all these details, uh, it takes a lot of time. This video was made over three days. So it took me three days, about four hours each day to, to build this. And from the outside there is no real progress. The weather is still good so I can leave the doors open. Of course it's, all, it's already November so probably in a few weeks I have to close the doors and close the curtains so we'll stay warm there because it's a non-heated uh, workshop. I can have a small electric heater, but uh, yeah, it's really not really heated. But that's okay, I can, you can dress for that, right? Okay, finishing up the last part of the attach angle. Clicking it all together. Next time I'm going to work on the rudder pedals and the brake pedals which is one construction. 
Okay, continuing building my pie in the sky.